And all of this after a, a two alarm or a big fire here and something you don't always see. Firefighters were forced to wear body armor, bulletproof vest. That after the first reports come in that there might be ammunition inside the burning home, might be a man with a gun inside the burning home. It all leads to a tense situation for the first responders. Look at this. There's still no water on it. No water on it because it's not safe. As firefighters wait to rush in, they need protection, armed protection from CB Valley Police. Officers heavily armed with their assault rifles, some taking cover behind fire engines, others standing right beside the firefighters, watching their backs as they fight the fire. And then it was just one squad car, then it was another and another, and then they started getting out and they had their ARs out and they were, they were posting, one posted on top of the fire truck, a couple went around, you know, the side over here. Tense moments as firefighters are even forced to wear body armor, bulletproof vest. We had Simi Valley Police Department on scene with us providing force protection to make sure all extinguishment operations were conducted in a safe manner. That after police say a domestic dispute probably ignited this fire, allegedly set by a man who may have been in the house, possibly using an accelerant to burn down the house. And police say they even receive a report of weapons inside that house. That's why no one taking any chances. The suspect is later found hiding in a backyard and rushed to the ER, suffering cuts on his arm, all while the firefight goes on. It was big. It was a big fire. Um, I mean, it started out really little, but they wouldn't let anybody get near it to put it out. It's a two-alarmer, a fast-burning fire right in the middle of this dense neighborhood on Martyr Ave. Firefighters fight, and then they're able to keep it from spreading, protecting the nearby homes after being forced to protect themselves wearing that body armor. They give them body armor and made them, everybody stay back, everything. How crazy is that you have to give firefighters body armor? Yeah, I mean, well, you got to be careful. Now, live while this fire is out, the investigation is still wide open. They want to find out what started the fire, was an accelerant used, but everybody here agreeing, especially the neighbors, with it's this fire burning so fast and so quickly they were able to keep it from spreading to other homes, no other homes damaged, and only the suspect, the only one who's rushed off, injured. For now, we're live here at Simi Valley. Back to both of you.